You've heard his voice all over the internet. It's that warm, unctuous tone that only a true professional podcaster could have. I'm delighted to welcome Kanan Flowers, the creative director of that studio. Hello, Kanan. Hey, Larry. How's it going? See, I rest my case right there. I don't need to say a thing. I'm going to sound like a second tenor next to you. It's good to have you with us. How are you doing today? You have been doing a lot of stuff. You have Barry White. Stop channeling Barry White. I'm already <laughs> humiliated. But, you know, one of the things that people don't know about you, they know about that post show, and they know of all of your postings on the, on the buzz, but on the, on the web. But sure. tell us about that studio. Absolutely. Uh, so that studio is a, uh, a pre-production, production, and post-production studio that we started in November. Myself and my business partner, a guy named Alan Bell. He's, uh, you might know him from uh, 500 Days of Summer, The Hunger Games, Amazing Spider-Man. Uh, if, as you know, before that, we'd been doing that post-show and we'd been doing this experiment, or well, what I called an experiment of Scruffy TV, which is this idea of, you know, can we build a worldwide, global, you know, distributed uh, post-production facility that can do high-quality visual effects and they could, you know, deliver things that aren't terrible, uh, you know, to, uh, to our <laughs> Which clients. is sometimes hard to do. Well, you know, when you start spreading people out around the world, it actually turns out to be a lot harder than you think, mm. right? You have to, you do asset management, you have to get people uh, involved in some kind of workflow, and that workflow has to be something that people can actually use, right? And so we had, you know, for a while we had this sort of Frankenstein's monster of, you know, FedExing hard drives around, and uh, you know, using Dropbox and all these other solutions, and it just took it took us about uh, 18 months to 22 months to figure out the workflow. I like to say we like to fail forward, <laughs> uh, and then we we uh, turned that company Scruffy TV that ex that grand experiment because I mean honestly, who's going to call it a real company Scruffy TV, right? Yeah, but look at who's, who's going to call a studio that studio. Well, hopefully the uh, rest of Hollywood, when they see us coming at their heels. <laughs> but why get back into production? I mean, you were doing a good job of, of doing the, the podcasts and doing Scruffy TV. You were definitely staying busy, and visible is not the word that begins to no, describe you. That's very sweet of you. Um, well, you know, my first love has always been filmmaking and the independent filmmaking community. Um, I would challenge pretty much anyone on this planet to tell me a, a movie that's better than Jim Jarmusch's Ghost Dog. There was no question Whitaker. in my mind. I think that, uh, you know, I love that. I love that whole community of filmmakers. I love that, that independent spirit. And so that studio is an opportunity for us to not only help independent filmmakers by giving them tools and resources and uh, finishing funds uh, and even a distribution pipeline for places like Netflix, Netflix and Hulu and iTunes and things like that, uh, but also, you know, to just embrace that community in a way that I think that community has been so kind to embrace us over the years. So what's your goals for that studio? Well, our goals are kind of simple. Um, we want to continue to make fun, original content that we believe in. I don't know if you saw the teaser for 1820, but uh, we have a giant alien frog jumping through the snow, and we just did it to see if we could. Like, can we make something <laughs> that we love? And, and the answer is yes. Are well, you looking to do short form? You looking to do long form comedies, uh, dramas? We're, we're looking to do long form. So on the on the plate right now are we have a feature film called Hero Punk, which I'm I'm sure you heard of. It's a mm -hmm. 96 minute. It's actually picture locked. Uh, shot on 1,100 square foot green screen. It's a full feature film like Sin City, except it's a comic book come to life. Uh, those who know me know that I'm into basically superheroes, comic books, and dystopian futures. Basically, so. you're not yet. 15. Are That's you? true. Internally, <laughs> I'm still reading Neuromancer. Um, so, so our goal is to produce original content, absolutely. Our other goal, and, and probably our primary goal, is to help other independent filmmakers uh, you know, get to a place where their stuff can see distribution. What is it that drives you to share as much as you do? Um, you know, I think it goes back to what we talked about earlier. I was, you know, I grew up very poor. And I grew up in a, in a world where uh, my entire family, everyone around me said, you will never be a filmmaker. Filmmaking is Hollywood, filmmaking is special. It's all of these different things and you can't get into it, right? Uh, and so I don't want anyone else to ever have to go through that again. I want people to be able to reach out. I mean, we have this beautiful global community where like if you want to talk to me right now, you can tweet me at I am Kanan and I will respond. You know, you can pick up the phone, you can call me, and if I don't know you, I will talk to you, right? And it's, I don't, I'm not looking for stalkers, okay, but I want you, I want to be accessible to you and I want to be able to give you the things that you need and I want to be able to take all this scar tissue that I have from 15 years of just failing like a complete moron 
you know, and I want to be able to have you not fail and have you be successful because at the end of the day, you know what matters is your ability to deliver a story to the audience who cares and about that Kay, story. Where can people go on the web to learn more? Uh, that's, Quickly. That's studio.com. That studio, all one word, T H A T. That studio.com. Canaan Flowers is the voice you're listening to. Canaan, thanks. Sorry. Right.